Hi, in this quick demo, I'm going to show a couple of new features that were added during this sprint. First, I'm going to show the support to add or remove disks from a VM reconfigure request. Just wanted to point out something that um, currently this feature is only supported for VMware VMs and also when a single VM is selected to be reconfigured. So here we go. I'm going to select a single VM from the list of VMs and press reconfigure selected items. As you can see, we added this new table disks here and that's displaying the existing disks on this VM and I'm going to go ahead add a new one and um, disk size is a required field to add a disk and there are a couple of other fields that you can select I'll hit add here and I I'm going to add one more so as you can see the new ones that I just added are being displayed in the, with, in the blue background just some visual difference so you can tell the there's these ones are the newly added ones and um, if you want you can delete an existing one and as soon as I hit delete button it marks the one that I just deleted in the red background just uh, another visual difference so if you want you can go ahead and cancel the delete or you can keep it the way it is if you like it and if you want you can cancel the one that you just added that's going to go away from the table and I I'm going to add one more and I'm going to hit submit this is going to bring me to the list of requests screen and the one that on the top is the one that I just added I'm going to hit go to the summary screen of that request and as you can see it shows that I added two disks and I removed one disk and if you would like you can go to edit this request and you can make changes here if you like I'm going to hit cancel out of this and then I'm going to show you the next feature that was added that was in the orchestration templates area so um, in the previous previous prints or previous build we used to show all kinds of orchestration templates in the uh, catalogs explorer but during this sprint we made a change to only show the orderable templates in catalogs explorer so as you can see in the heat templates currently i only have one orderable template so i'm going to go to cloud stacks and go to the stack that has a non-orderable template and going to this is the new screen that was added and now you can um, make this non orderable template into an orderable one or you can copy this one into a new orderable template so I'm going to go hit make orchestration template orderable button and this changes the non orderable template into an orderable one and then I'm going to go to view this orchestration template in catalogs and as you can see now I have two of these and that concludes my demo. Thank you.